Heads cracking, this is South Cackalack. You practically back in time. Don't get caught ass out, you might get left behind. It's just a rapture, never trust the pastor. Find another master. It's the rapture, here's the greener pasture. Born in a disaster. This is South Cackalack, north of the worst state. East of where I moved to, violence got the worst rate. The voice rate, a lot moved. The fourth fate somehow bloomed. My silent, my soon. Doom from the womb. Let's check it. Tell these niggas where you from, nigga. Tell these niggas where you from, nigga. What is balance when you standing in the ocean? What is action when nobody got the lotion? What is action when you lack the passion? What is satisfaction when everybody is passing? How the fuck you gain attraction and rise up? Despite us, they spit at us. Nowadays, when we spit, it's the games that us and who we trust. Church on every corner, but the prayers empty. Calling out to God, praying the devil never get me. This is South Cackalack. Better keep a strap. These niggas ain't lurking, then these crackers on your back. How I stay above the water while everybody was drowning? How you isolate when the pressure's surrounding? Just how we do it. My people was not affluent. My father was pretty truant. My ego was unaffluent. I promise there's nothing to it. Promise I gotta make it. I promise I couldn't fake it. I promise this to my mama. I put my state in my statements. Tell these niggas where you from, nigga. South Cackalack. Tell these niggas where you from, nigga. South Cackalack. Tell these niggas where you from, nigga. Tim Davis, I'm at Bond Beverage Company. Called Timonade. It's lemonade infused fruit, natural herbs. The reason why I feel like it's so special and unique, but um, I'm a cancer survivor, so I got into it. And uh, you know, I don't use nothing but the fresh ingredients, 9.5 pH alkaline tiny water. Uh, array of natural herbs, aloe vera, uh, and, a, and, a, and a special blend of fruits. I got over a thousand flavors. I actually grew up on the side of town, uh, I'm on the west in Anderson, South Carolina. I don't even like bragging on the drink. But, uh, this is just three flavors: black panther, front porch, and that you see. Front porch is going right. All these are going right here. These three actually going right here. Front porch. I'm sitting right here. I was sitting right here when I tasted it for the first time, and the name came like that. The black pepper, of course, that's an old chain, electricity, that's where we at. And that's, wow, this is crazy because this drink right here, right, the house that we're sitting at is one of the most, arguably the most historic houses in our city. Um, my house in the museum, those two trees right there is in the original picture of the house when it was built in like 1890 or something like that. And, um, this was the original house of William Whitney. He got a statue downtown in front of the courthouse. I don't know if she broke the city and uh, got footage of the statue. 
my knees on my P-Row spot. But anyway, um, he's the person who invented the hydroelectric current, which in turn turns water into power. Like you see these power plants built on water with the turbines and stuff like dams and shit like that. He started that at Harvard Lake, which used to be called Portman Shoals back in the days. And uh his grandfather, uh Joseph Whitner and Robert Anderson found it where found it Hudson. Okay. Robert Anderson now, you know what I'm saying? Uh New Middle School or whatever. Hello everyone, it's your boy Yada, in Anderson, South Carolina, Fashion Studio A. Uh, shout out to my business partner, Joyce Grooms and Harrison Ferguson. Those are my co-partners in ownership of Fashion Studio A. Yada, first of all, Yada straight out of Dallas Breeze. That's where it all started. So I was born and raised in Anderson, South Carolina, right here, straight out of Dallas Bridge. So it was only right for me to put it on the t-shirt. You know what I mean, got a brand, everything. So um, I just I've been in the fashion my whole life um, as a kid. Uh, I grew up in the '80s, the '90s, so you know fashion was really high alert. Um, you know a lot of hip hop going on. That's when things was breaking through, and you know it's just uh, our culture. You know the black culture, the urban culture. Um, it's all about uh, you know style and um, dancing and music. I mean it was just a great clothing line to. Um, you know, just give back, uh, you know, to the community uh, and inspire people to, uh, you know, basically chase your dreams, go for your dreams and accomplish them, you know what I mean? It stands for Young and Handsome Dapper Apparel. My real name is Ken Yada by ADA, so when I started the brand, I was like, I need something hot, I need something catchy, I need something simple. Um, I was like, man, you know, I'm branding myself, let me, you know, brand my name. <laughs> so I took the last four letters of my name, which is Y-A-D-A, which stands for Yada. Yo, it sounds hot, it's me, it's dope, it's, it's everything, it's who I am. So I kind of took that spin and that's how I spent off with the name, which is cool. Um, I'm a spiritual person and everything like that, so it ain't no secret. And I, I feel like uh, the Most High Yahweh, the Most High, you know, he had a little intervention in that as well because I added the H in there out of all things. And Yada, Y-A-H-D-A in Hebrew means he knows, meaning God knows. So. You know, I think that's dope too. So you kind of have. Uh, we're building this thing up from the ground up. We got one here in Anderson, South Carolina, in the mall, and then I also have one. Uh, we have one in, in Atlanta. We have a store in the mall of Georgia. Um, right. Uh, we all about giving back to the community. Uh, shout out to uh, Black Legacy Chain Breakers and y'all, of course. Um, this is just what we do. We give back. Um, some of you may follow us. Speaking of that, let me go ahead and plug that. You can follow us at Shop Yada on Instagram. That's Shop Yada. S H O P Y A H D A. That's our Instagram name. Facebook is just Yada Y A H D A. You can find us there. Uh, we do have an online store, uh, ShopYada.com. You know, so we're around. You can get to the merch. You can you can get it online. You can, um, and also, uh, Stop the Violence, got to give a shout out to uh, Emmanuel Donaldson as well. He's doing a lot of things in the community as far as helping Stop the Violence. He partnered up with us. And we just, you know, went to all the different communities. Went to uh, some Fabry Gardens, um, Anderson Garden, uh, Friendship Court, and just uh, Nick Forest Elementary. We gave our tablets and stuff out like there. And bikes for the kids, clothes, stuff like that. So you got to give back. That's that's the key to it, you know. Um, and I'm giving them an opportunity they never had before. So that's what we out here, man. We out here grinding. And, you know, be on the lookout for us. 2021, we up. Y'all, your boy Y'all, shopyall.com. <laughs> so one more question, Kenny. Sure. Uh, last but not least, I, I know you're from Anderson. Anderson, South Carolina. And uh, oh, what, <laughs> what is it about that hometown? What is it about Anderson as a whole um, that you love about? Can you... Emphasize more of the Anderson. Oh man, let me tell you, my Anderson. Anderson is just a secret town. <laughs> Anderson is a special, special place. You know what I'm saying? We're a small town, like she said, secret town. A little small place on the map, but I mean, Anderson is just a special, unique place. We've always had a lot of flavor. We've always been more advanced than, uh, to be honest, than a lot of the uh, bigger cities. You know, just this little small town, we've been ahead of the game in a lot of different areas. So many different things I can speak on uh, as far as so much talent in this area. 
Um, and we got a lot of people uh, that came from here. Like I said, RIP, rest in peace, uh, Chad Bozeman. Got to shout him out. You know, uh, we grew up together uh, in the same time frame. Um, he went to hand, I went to West Side, but, you know, we knew each other. Good brother, man. Genuine guy, great guy. Shout out to him. Shout out to Sean Ellis, man. We graduated together. He made it out, uh, you know, retired from the NFL. But in addition to that, I mean, it's just a lot of um, people here from Anderson, South Carolina, that has so many different gifts and talents beyond this big old world that we live in. I mean, just right here in this small town. We slept on, but, you know what I'm saying, we're going to keep making the mark and putting us on the map. You know, that's the goal. Hi, I'm Nora Johnson. Some people know me as Chanel. I'm from Anderson, South Carolina. I was born and raised here, and I'm the owner of Boss Culture, which is clothing that is affordable for my generation or young. Um, Boss Culture is basically clothing that has describing words of you or defining you as a person. It, a clothing brand that suits me, it suits everyone else around me. And I don't only have different defined clothing, I have custom jeans as well. For custom, um, I did the holes, the holes in these and all. Younger, I always wanted to go to fashion school, I always wanted to be a designer, so that's where that started from. And I took, well, my 11th grade year in high school was the year that I decided to start doing this after we got quarantined. That's when I stepped outside of my box and actually started doing stuff and working with fine clothing. It was just simply boss culture and that was it. But after a while, I stepped outside of my box and I started doing defined clothing and people like that more. And not only you can, you can pick any words you want to pick, not just something I have. If you, if there's something I don't have, you are welcome to um, create or tell me what you want and I'm able to put it on whether a t-shirt, sweatshirt, whatever it is that you want. So how do they uh, get in contact? You go ahead and plug that information in. I do have a Facebook page. Um, it is Boss Culture, just Boss just underscore Boss Culture. And you can contact me on either one of those and I will respond. Um, that's how you can get in touch order with me at the moment. Later, in the middle of the year maybe, later on in the year, I will have a website up and you will be able to shop with me on there. All right, thank you. <laughs>